YouTube and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Beer Review. Today we will be looking at a beer from BC. This is Philips Blue Buck. So Philips Blue Buck is 5% alcohol by volume. What does it say over here? It's always open season. To bag a few of these session ales. Bronze in color, this medium bodied beer is characterized by never mind. Water, barley, hops, and yeast. So this is just supposed to be a session ale. Crisp, refreshing. Session ale that is now spewing up onto me. <clears throat> it probably needed to find room to go to, though. Um, in this beer, I I did drop this beer when I bought it at the LCBO a few about a week ago. I bought it about a week ago, but when I dropped it, it did leave quite the dent. So opening it up there, that beer probably just needed to find somewhere to go, and my crotch was where it wanted to go. Not actually all that bothered about it either. Uh, if you're wondering what I'm talking about, right there is where I dropped it. Uh, yeah. It was a good drop. There's some more over here, too. Alrighty, so Phillips Blue Buck. It said, uh, copper in color. And yeah, I guess I could give it that. It does have that, uh, amber hue to it. Head left pretty quickly. There it is. Let's give it a sniff. Oh, that smells lovely. Uh, lots of malt. Lots of malt. And under under attenuated malt. Just very malty. Very sweet. Not really anything else. Just malty and sweet. Let's try it. Cheers. Okay, well, you know what? This is just a slight, this is like a slightly hopped Irish red. And that's what it is, a slightly hopped Irish red. And I'm perfectly okay with a slightly hopped Irish red. It is a very good session beer. Because you could sit back and drink it forever. Now it did say West Coast Hops. I don't know if I'd say it's West Coast Hops myself. It kind of comes off almost English. It's, it's a little dirty and uh, rustic. And uh, dirty, rustic, and... Well, just dirty. Dirty, rustic, and uh, grassy, shall we say. I'm not really getting resin per se or anything. Uh, but it, does that matter? Not really. Is it a beautiful beer? Yes, it's a beautiful beer. Can you see a big pile of laundry that I just noticed on the camera? Yes, you can see a big pile of laundry. Um, I'm going to close that door if I review again at this angle. Uh, anyway, uh, is it a good beer? Yes, it's a great beer. Very, very sweet, very under attenuated. There's a nice roastiness to it. There's that dirty, grungy, uh, English-like finish but very very easy to drink yeah again it reminds me of an Irish ale and I really like that just a little more hopped but a lot less hopped than I would have expected from a Phillips beer which makes this beer very approachable I'm going to give this a 7.75 out of 10 I really like this beer thank you guys for watching this was the Rhino looking at Phillips Blue Buck. Bye.